Ever wondered why your Etsy store isn't getting the traffic it deserves? Could it be your SEO strategies? Welcome to the world of Etsy SEO, where the rules are ever-changing and yesterday's best practices could be today's penalties. With Etsy's algorithm continually evolving, it's crucial for sellers to keep up and adapt. We're about to delve into five outdated Etsy SEO strategies that might be holding you back. Stay tuned if you want to ensure your Etsy store is in line with the most effective SEO practices. Let's dive into some outdated Etsy SEO strategies that could be holding you back. First on our list is keyword stuffing. This is when you repeat keywords excessively in your title or description, hoping to improve your ranking. But here's the catch. Etsy has advised against this practice. It doesn't improve your ranking, and it can create a poor user experience by making your listings difficult to read. Next, we have the neglect of long tail keywords. These are more specific keyword phrases that shoppers are likely to use when they're closer to making a purchase. In the past, focusing on general keywords might have been enough, but now, ignoring these long tail keywords can mean missing out on potential customers who know exactly what they're looking for. Thirdly, we have the outdated practice of neglecting tags and categories. These are essential tools for categorizing your products and making them more discoverable. Ignoring them can make it harder for shoppers to find your products, even if they're exactly what the shopper is searching for. Next on the list is poor use of images. High quality images are not just about aesthetics. They play a crucial role in attracting users and increasing click-through rates. Simply put, the better your images, the more likely users are to click on your listing. Lastly, we have the practice of overlooking social media promotion. While it's not directly related to Etsy SEO, social media can significantly boost your visibility and drive traffic to your listings. In the past, relying solely on Etsy's platform might have been enough. But in this era of social media dominance, failing to promote your products on these platforms could mean missing out on a large chunk of potential customers. These strategies once worked, but now they may be doing more harm than good. So, what's the solution? Stay tuned as we dive into the updated Etsy SEO strategies and a proven strategy to drive traffic to your listings. You might ask, so what if my SEO strategies are outdated? Well, let's dive into that. Outdated strategies like keyword stuffing or low quality images can have a surprising ripple effect. They can lower your store's visibility in search results leading to decreased traffic to your listings. This, in turn, could mean fewer eyes on your products and ultimately, fewer sales. Imagine it this way. Your Etsy store is like a brick-and-mortar shop. If you're hidden in a back alley instead of a bustling street, fewer people are going to stumble upon your store. And if they do, but your storefront isn't appealing, they might just keep walking. Moreover, outdated strategies can also create a poor user experience. If your listings are hard to read because of excessive keyword repetition, potential customers might get frustrated and leave. Outdated strategies can significantly limit your store's potential. Now that we've covered what not to do, let's explore some updated SEO strategies for your Etsy store. First off, let's talk about keyword relevance. It's crucial to prioritize keyword relevance over repetition. Etsy's algorithm values relevance, so make sure your keywords relate directly to your product. It's not about how many times you use a keyword, but how accurately it describes your item. Next, consider using long tail keywords. These are phrases that are more specific and less common, but directly target your audience. For example, instead of using silver necklace, you might use handmade silver heart locket. Long tail keywords can help you reach the customers who are looking for exactly what you're selling. Thirdly, optimize your tags and categories. Tags and categories on Etsy are not just organizational tools, they're also SEO tools. By accurately categorizing your product and using relevant tags, you're giving Etsy's algorithm more context about your product. This can help your item appear in relevant searches. Moving on, let's discuss the importance of image quality. High quality images aren't directly related to SEO, but they can significantly affect your click-through rate. A clear, well-lit photo that accurately represents your product can attract more clicks. And the more clicks you get, the higher Etsy's algorithm will rank your product. Finally, don't underestimate the power of social media. Promoting your Etsy store on social media platforms can drive more traffic to your listings. This increased traffic can boost your product's ranking on Etsy. 
Plus, social media promotion can help you reach potential customers who might not be on Etsy. Remember, Etsy's algorithm is always changing. These strategies are based on the current algorithm, but what works today might not work tomorrow. Keep up with Etsy's updates and adjust your SEO strategy as needed. One more thing to remember is that SEO is a long-term strategy. You might not see results overnight, but don't get discouraged. Keep refining your keywords, optimizing your listings, and promoting your store. Over time, your efforts can significantly improve your store's visibility and sales. Implementing these strategies can significantly boost your store's visibility and sales. Are you ready for a game-changing tip? Let's dive into a proven strategy that has revved up the traffic to Etsy listings for many sellers. This strategy is a blend of two key elements, high-quality images and strategic keywords. Yes, you heard it right. It's as simple and as complex as that. Let's start with high-quality images. You may wonder, what's the big deal about images? Well, they're a big deal indeed. Consider this. When potential buyers are browsing through Etsy, what's the first thing that catches their eye? It's the image. A high-quality, engaging image can stop a browser in their tracks. It's your first chance to make an impression, and as they say, a picture is worth a thousand words. So, make sure your images are not only high resolution, but also tell a story about your product. Show it in use, display different angles, give it context, make your product irresistible. Now let's talk about strategic keywords. Keywords are the bread and butter of SEO, but they need to be used wisely. Gone are the days when you could stuff your title with keywords and hope for the best. Etsy's algorithm has evolved, and so should your strategy. Your keywords need to be relevant, specific, and strategic. They should accurately represent your product, while also tapping into what your potential buyers might be searching for. Balance is key here. Use your keywords in your title, but also in your tags and product description. This way, you're not only pleasing the Etsy algorithm, but also providing valuable information to your potential buyers. Combining high-quality images with strategic keywords is not a magic bullet, but it's a proven strategy that's worked wonders for many Etsy sellers. It's about creating a compelling visual story while also making your product easily discoverable. It's about attracting and engaging your potential buyers. And the best part, it's a strategy that can be tailored to your unique products and audience. This strategy has worked wonders for many Etsy sellers, and it could do the same for you. Let's quickly recap what we've learned today. We started with a deep dive into five outdated Etsy SEO strategies that you should ditch. Remember, keyword stuffing, where keywords are repeated excessively in your title, is one of those antiquated tactics. Etsy itself has advised against this, stating that it doesn't improve your ranking and can actually create a poor user experience. Next, we highlighted the negative impacts of these outdated strategies, emphasizing how they can hinder your chances of ranking in Etsy's search results and prevent you from driving significant traffic to your listings. But it wasn't all doom and gloom. We then shifted gears to discuss the new updated Etsy SEO strategies that you should be implementing. The importance of using high quality images in your listings was a key point. These not only attract users, but can also significantly increase your click-through rates. Last but not least, we shared a proven strategy for success. This is a game-changing approach that has the potential to revolutionize your Etsy business. It's not just about understanding the old practices and the new ones, but also about knowing how to adapt and evolve in this ever-changing marketplace. Remember, in the ever-changing world of Etsy, staying updated with the latest SEO strategies is the key to staying ahead. Happy selling. Before we wrap up, we have a small request. If you found this video helpful and want to stay updated with more Etsy growth tips, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Give this video a thumbs up if you found it informative. We would love to hear your thoughts or any questions you might have. So please drop a comment below and don't stop here. There's a wealth of knowledge available on our channel to maximize your Etsy growth. Thank you for watching. Remember, your Etsy success is just a few clicks away. Happy selling.